To say that it has been an eventful and exciting time on College Hill these days would be an understatement. The college is in the final stages of its very successful capital campaign. It's Lafayette Lehigh Football Week. And of course, Sherita Freeman, our new director of athletics, has recently unveiled her new strategic vision for the college athletic program. Hello, everybody. My name is John Leone, and we're very pleased to have with us today two people at the center of that effort to enhance our athletic program. I'm here with Vice President for Development and College Relations at the college, Kim Spang, and our Vice President for Finance and Administration, Roger Demoreski. Uh, folks, first of all, welcome. Great, thank you, thanks for having me. Kim, I think it's your second foray with us. It is, thank you. Kim, let me go to you first. Obviously, Sharita's plan is enormously ambitious, um, and it's gonna take a lot to get it done. Um, working in your office with College Relations, uh, what has the uh, alumni reaction been in your view? Well, I will say this is definitely an exciting time for Lafayette. Our alumni are ready for this moment. Division One athletics has played a very big part of Lafayette's history for many, many decades. So I think our alumni are ready to really embrace this, um, be a part of this, and we want a winning culture. So we're ready. Yeah, and you know, Kim, obviously uh, we work together in our day jobs, and uh, uh, maybe this is a question you should be asking me, but I'll ask you instead. How much will it cost, and where is the money going to come from? Well, that's a very important question, and we know that it definitely will cost um, significant funds, and I think fundraising is going to play a big part of that. Part of what we're doing right now is working closely with Sharita and the athletic department to determine exactly how much the cost will be for this, and then what our responsibility will be in helping to support this. Let me turn now to you, Roger. Thank you, Kim. Uh, Roger, um, as, the, as the guy in the office, kind of beneath ship, you're pushing the buttons and pulling the levers and making this thing go in the right direction. Um, are there revenue sources beyond what the development office might be able to bring that can help support this plan? Uh, there are. I, th I think first, you know, we want to always be thankful and appreciative of our donors and their generosity. But I think there's three probably key areas. First, like with most programs, we have uh, ways to reallocate within the operating budget or assign new dollars. And so that is a process that would certainly apply to, to Sharita's plan. I think the second is Sharita has identified other areas of potential revenue, whether that's additional ticket sales, advertising, or even athletic camps. Uh, the difference is we've worked together with Sharita and come up with a program where we want to incentivize athletics. And so if there is additional revenue that is generated, we want that to go directly to the athletics department. We've done that successfully with guaranteed games for football, and we want to continue that success with this plan. You know, I've been here a long, long time, and uh, I know how central and important Lafayette's athletic program is to the broader campus community. And uh, I have to say, this is uh, 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 exciting that uh, to have our people at our vice presidential level uh, being as, as invested and involved. Kim, uh, uh, you're from an athletic family yourself. Uh, maybe uh, talk a little bit about your view as to how and why an athletic program is so important to a school like Lafayette. I think Lafayette definitely um, is a place where people really want to excel and have an outstanding experience both on and off the field. And what's great is I've met thousands of alumni across every decade and part of our culture is really uh, a group that wants to be excellent and want to help each other, a great network. And I think a big part of that is because athletics, Division One athletics plays a big part of our campus community. So it is a, it's an important part of what we do and who we are. And I think this next stage as we think about bringing Sharita and other uh, coaches out on the road to talk with our alumni, it will be a moment to kind of bring our community together to support an incredible and important initiative at Lafayette. Thank you, Kim. Uh, Roger, a wise man once told me that the, most of the world's issues can be resolved by uh, simply implementing two fundamental things, common sense and dollars and cents. You're the dollars and cents guy, but I know you've been at places where uh, Lafayette has, or I'm sorry, where athletics uh, has played a very important role in the culture. Same question to you. Uh, how do you perceive that here at Lafayette? Yeah, you know, I, I've always uh, admired the student athlete. I think the ability to balance uh, the education in the classroom and what they also learn on the playing field or playing surface, the ability to manage their time, uh, competing priorities. I think that's just a great life skill. As Kim said, it's a great part of our community and I've certainly seen that other, at other places, but it's certainly special here at Lafayette. Well, I can tell from uh, just my presence being on the campus, uh, I don't know that I've ever seen this kind of excitement around real support for the athletic program. I hope that everyone out there pays close attention, read the plan carefully, and when and where you can, please help.